let's go down memory lane here and let's try to think of our our favorite moments of 2023. Joe, you might have technical difficulties with your screen. You look like you're you smoked a nice bat. Let let me restart. You guys hear me though, right? We hear you, but I mean, you could keep that image of you like that. Like no, you look I, like I kind of don't want to. So you look I'll, like you I'll just like, inhaled shut, a nice. I'm shutting off your camera for a second. A night you just no, inhaled a nice the entire, big it's one. The entire buddy. screen is uh, is frozen. I'll let Chris go and I'll restart and I'll I'll come back. To yeah, it. yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> well, all right, Chris. I, Chris I, before I, yeah, yeah, go for it. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to stick with. Well, for the Canadians, I'm going to try to stick with this season because I feel as though when we wrap up the season, we like to go over the best of the whole year or the season okay. itself. Yeah. Uh, so for this season, there are two Montreal Canadiens moments that genuinely stand out. Um, there's a third moment that I want to bring up, but the sure. number one moment, Caden Gooley, overtime goal against the Boston oh. Bruins. That was a very special moment. Like I, It was a very feel-good moment. It had been a long time since we had beat the Bruins, the you know rivalry and everything. Like, I really fucking love that moment. You know who else had that moment? Which I'm moment? Not... So, Joe, I said, welcome Kaden. back. Yeah. Oh. Thank you, thank you. Go, uh, go, Chris. So, I was saying, I have three moments that really stood out, but Caden Gooley overtime goal against Boston was a really, 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 like, nice one. Really felt great. Like, absolutely loved it. Number two, just There's another. Hold on, hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. There's another curfew boy that had that moment. Zook. Okay. Okay. Z okay. Zook, Zook, Zook had that moment as well. So. Okay. The number two, and and I hope to God he comes back. But when when Jack I fought Ryan Reeves on opening night, I yeah. swear to God, like I it was stronger than me. Like I got out of my seat and I was standing and like my heart was going. I wasn't. Like I'm watching yeah. this through a TV screen and my, my heart was going big time. And I was so happy when he tossed them into that net. And then we watched the yeah. fans cry for about a week. Well, I was so we, rewarded. Yeah, and, I know. I and, know. <laughs> and the number three moment awesome. talking about Leafs fans crying. Uh, this goes beyond Montreal, but when uh, Toronto and the whole city chanted, we want Florida and, and they got eliminated yeah, in, this summer, yeah, uh, in yeah, five yeah, yeah, games. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that just has to go for 2023. That's just the cherry on top of the Sunday type <laughs> moment for uh, for your boy GQ, Chris. Um, <laughs> here, I'll, I'll mention that this this is Anthony that said it that sent it to us in our group chat. But I think so far his favorite moment is uh, is when Slavkowski scored the shootout winner against uh, against Buffalo Ooh. and his his uh, are you not entertained uh, celebration. And that's actually. That's actually one of my favorite moments too. But before I actually say mine, I I, I want Joey uh, to go first. Uh, it sucks because um, Chris and Zook mentioned <laughs> it. Mine would have been just a win against Boston because we haven't been in Boston in four mm -hmm. years. So okay. it was just it was taking the monkey off the back and finally relieving. Uh, finally felt relieved because we haven't beaten our rivals in four years, four mm -hmm. long fucking years. Yeah. So. Uh, I don't really have other favorite moments to be quite honest. I was really on the tank, so those are not. I mean, <laughs> I have moments of when we lose, but hey ho, that's that was it for me. But as a high moment, really, it's the only one that for me that stands out is the one against Boston. Okay, yeah, uh, I mean, obviously the Jack I uh, fight with Reeves was one of my favorites. I I enjoyed. I enjoyed the, the the rush of anticipation and what the fuck is going to happen moments of the lottery draft when we're all at this place. And like, pick, so. so, well, I enjoyed that, but did I enjoy the draft? I don't know if I enjoyed the draft itself. I mean, I I, I still like uh, I still like Reinbacker, despite what despite popular belief. But I, I think about that draft is I loved when we were doing the show live on YouTube and fucking Joey was ahead of us. <laughs> and before, before we all knew the pick, Joey, I'm gone. I'm gone. Ciao. Bye. Fuck this shit. <laughs> He's it just go, his screen goes blank. I'm gone. I'm going. Oh I'm leaving. Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm done. Okay, goodbye. 
See you guys. They even rhyme back. I wonder where Mitchkov is going to be picked. <laughs> Joey just bounced. <laughs> I had to leave. I couldn't stay. I can't consider that a high moment. It's not a I favorite. It's a low well, no, moment. Was, it was just my favorite. Like I think I don't know if it's a Montreal Canadian moment. It's probably more of a curfew boys moment of 2023. But uh, but yeah, I I think um, yeah, I think I think that had to be my. My favorite moment. It's 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 a bit tough too. Like uh, I think, because um, again, like it's only it's only October, right? Last season, last season was tough. But yeah, like the yeah that goalie moment. Actually, no, here I got one. I got one. I just I can't believe I was thinking of it before, but I completely forgot. The Cole Caulfield goal in overtime when we were there, Chris, you and I against Columbus. Oh my god, that was the yeah. seventh one, right? I remember that was the seventh overtime winner. Yes, um, and yeah, 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 yeah. But like, but. Just the way that game went down, uh, they were down 3-0. They fought back, and, you know, Gallagher gets a last-minute penalty. We all thought it was over. They kill it, and then just fucking Cole comes in on the right on yes on the right side, fucking snipes it. I think I think for me, for now, I'm going to use that for your mode just, just because we were there. It was live. That like, was, live that was on my birthday. It was that on his, was the day oh my God, like, Cole gave me... Too. Yeah, I can't believe I overlooked that one because that was a freaking <laughs> birthday gift and a half of a game. That was amazing. I, I that was one of the loudest I've screamed in oh, recent yeah. memory. We, we blew, I, I was know one I of the loudest. Voice. I blew my voice that that with like we all everybody lost their shit. It was so much yeah. fun. That was that was so much fun. I mean, I, I I've been lucky enough this year to go to quite a few games than I usually do. Not only the Montreal Canadiens, but to the Laval Rockets, like. Even even the Laval Rocket game, one game against the Belleville Senators, they were down 4-0. Just the way they fought back was it, it, it was awesome to see. You know, even watching Arbor Jack guys first goal in the minors was was mm. was pretty was pretty fun to see. So boys, that I I think 2023 is a wrap. 